Thanks for stopping by Pete's Garage. Well, you may recognize this engine. This is the 440 that I just built. Guy put it in the car and loved it, but brought it back because I have to rebuild it. And I'm going to talk about that in a future video because we're going to talk about diagnosing engine problems. So I have a new block. I got to rebuild it. I got another block. Tore it all apart and I have one problem. There is one plug in the rear of this block that I cannot get out. I tried everything. Heating the block, heating the plug, freezing the plug, multiple different lubricants, sockets, everything I could, everything I possibly could to get this out. I don't want to drill it out because I don't want to drill a hole and use an easy out in a plug or anything that goes into one of the oil passageways because I don't want to risk getting some metal shavings in there and it ending up in the engine and ruining the engine. So I got to get this thing out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to weld a bolt onto it. This is the plug I can't get out. There's two of them on the back of the block. This one came right out, but this one must have been in there a long time. I tried everything. It's starting to round over. It's not going to go anywhere. So I'm going to weld, butt weld a, a, a bolt on the end of this to see if I can get it out. I have to admit the smaller, I think it was a grade 5 bolt, sheared right off. The higher grade bolt and a bigger bolt, see if it doesn't twist off. Hope it comes off this time. It should be hot enough, I just welded it on there. And I had to put a ton of weld on there just to get it to cover. Let's see if it breaks off this time. Oh, look at that. Oh yeah. Holy crap that plug was in there. Still hot, smoking hot. But there you go. Welding a bolt on there was the only way I can get it out. Now I realize if you don't have a welder or any welding equipment, you can't do that, which makes it very difficult. But if you do, simply welding a bolt on there usually does the trick. Thanks for stopping by Pete's Garage. <laughs>